I'm gonna be totally honest. I am not the best Minecraft player. So, YouTube and all who inhabit it, today sparks a new series. One where by the end, I promise you, I will be the best Minecraft player in the world. Now, I know what you're thinking. How exactly do you plan on doing this? Well, every good Minecraft player has to start out with something essential. Beating the game itself, of which I have not actually done. So, we have a starting point, let's get going. Oh, and uh, by the way, I'm Nito Z or Luke. Alright, new spawn, totally new, did not decide on the seed. Let's go punch some trees. Paul Source Jr. always said that you only need about six pieces of oak logs to start, but I was always an overachiever. Where are we gonna build our house, boys? Wait, no, not house. Like, starter, starter house. You, you know what I mean. Okay, we have many sheep around here and cows. Those will supply a stable source of food and we'll also be able to get a bed on the first night. I don't know why I'm playing this like a speed run. I feel like I am like trying to go as fast as I possibly can. I just want to find like a little cliffside bigger than that to just like dig a little small house into. Ooh, okay. I think I'm gonna start down here in this cave and we'll make a pickaxe to mine ourselves some cobblestone. With that cobble that we just gathered, we can make a sword. This is Hello Mario. A little scary. But I think it's a good idea to live down here. And you know, Paul Swords Jr. always taught me that you should always have a second exit out of your cave, but I don't, so I'm gonna stay here. It just so happens to be that we have some iron in here, so that's quite lucky. We can probably get acquired hardware fairly soon. And I would start digging in there, but there's bird poop everywhere, so I think I'll just start right in here. And this can be our little hut, our hidey hole. Hey, more iron. I think four furnaces will be enough for the time being. Let's see if I can go kill some sheep. I would wait for the iron and get some shears. I'll grab that iron later. And that iron too. Jeez, I'm so lucky with the iron. Yeah, I, I would wait for shears, but... Obviously, iron is a pretty valuable resource at this point in time, even though it doesn't seem like it since it, it is literally growing on trees for me. But I, I, for one thing, I'm not patient, and for another, I, I just want to go kill the sheep to fuel my bloodlust. Wait, I swear there were like a ton of sheep around here. Where are they? Sheep? Sheep? Hello? Yes! I need your skin. A sacrifice must be made. I will eat their raw meat. I know they're not cooked. Please don't sue me. I just, yeah, that's right, a one hit kill. Thing I wanted to do. I want to make a bed. Cause li li little known fact, actually very highly known fact, um, beds used to always be red. So I'm going to sleep through this night just to set my spawn point. And I think we're gonna go mining, since that's probably the best thing to do at this point in time. But before we do that, go out and kill some more things to get more food. Hello, tree. This tree will stay here preserved forever. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to name him yet. Um, hopefully he doesn't make like a tree and leave. <laughs> Please stay. I should probably make a chest. I'm definitely gonna need to go get more wood. Yeah, so I'm gonna go out and get some more wood, actually, and then I'll continue digging down that mine shaft. But you, you will stay here forever. You will be preserved. Oh, that is so satisfying. Last tree gave me exactly 64. For the time being, this will suffice us and we can actually get started with mining right there right there right there getting a little bit cramped in here in fact i'm extremely regretting the placement of said chests but hey what am i gonna do put them in the trash pit i might want to make some more pickaxes actually so i'll use the wood that's in my inventory and i want to keep cobblestone always keep cobblestone on you at all times you never know when it could come in handy when you're trying to get over like a lava pit or whatever 
iron and a cave. I mean, it's fairly far up and it looks like it only contains coal and iron most likely. But I mean, hey, ooh, maybe this goes further down actually. Yeah, we're already on 32. Okay, I should have come down here with a shield. I am just now remembering that and I'm terrified. So I'm gonna grab this iron and okay, no, I'm not. I'm going to make, this is not good. Something about making a data pack that just kind of like completely removes skeletons. And uh, I wanted to know if you guys were interested because I certainly am. Die. That's not a bad bow. We can put this back in our offhand for now until we encounter. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Here, I'm gonna use your friend's remains. Hey. <laughs> I got take aim. Okay, for first death, first death of the survival series. Hey, I mean that's why we're here. We're here to get better at Minecraft. You can't tell me that 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 was not planned. I hate this game. I hate it. I hate it. I've been playing it since like 2012, and I hate it. Every time I get hurt, I have to reorganize my entire freaking inventory. My shovel's gone too. Everything sucks. I'm sorry. We need to be positive in this situation. Okay, positivity only. <laughs> Ooh, I found my pickaxe. Ooh, shinies. I hate it when like you're in your inventory and like you know that there's a creeper. Like you, you, you just sit there and you hear the hissing of a creeper, but like it registers like just a tad bit late and you're in your inventory. So you got to reach your hand all the way up to the escape key, hit the escape button, then turn up quickly realize oh yeah i have a shield in my offhand but sometimes you don't have a shield in your offhand so you have to run away but it's too late to run away because you already spent let's grab my shovel stuff this is no longer a quest to get better at minecraft this is now oh my shovel's right there that was a that was a pretty short quest i didn't even get to do anything or stupid to hate my to do anything fun. Hello. No! <laughs> wow, stupidity, I can't do anything right. You suck. Pulsewars Jr. taught me that you always put your torches on the right so you can follow them back on the left. Oh, that's a death trap. I hope there aren't diamonds down there because that means I need to come out of my little comfort zone that is, uh, introversy. Is introversy a word? I was like trying to make like a haha -ha funny joke like I have social and an ex anxiety? Is that what that word is? This has just become me like saying words and then like getting confused by them. I'm gonna stop talking now and just play the game. I want to get to the bottom of this ravine because um, it's very mysterious and I'd like to get to the bottom of it. <laughs> that was a good joke. I Somebody please call help. Hello, zombie friends. How are you on this fight? No, go away. This is exactly why I'm making the data pack. Okay, I single-handedly took on that horde of zombies. Ah! Not today, thank you. Get it? Cause that's the name of the advancement. Making my way downtown. I'll grab. <gasps> <gasps> it's a first episode. It's a first episode. Let's make sure that there's no lava around them. What level are we on? How did we get to 11 already? Let's freaking go. I can hear lava near here and it, it, it's making me very upset. This is a pretty decent sized vein as well. That's six diamonds. That's enough for a sword and a pickaxe and then one. I mean, I'm pretty happy with that in the first episode. I didn't even get to like bedrock there and I already, already got myself like six diamonds. This. This- maybe I'm- maybe I don't even need to make a series about getting better at Minecraft. Maybe I'm already, like, prime human. Maybe- I mean, I, I don't know, man. But I'm gonna put- I'm gonna put all my valuables in here. And hey! Not a bad first episode at all. I, I'd say that that was pretty successful. And you know what? I hope you would too. And you know what else? What is- it's a thing that- that you- that you can do? You can leave a like on this video. And give me lots of subscriptions to boost my dopamine. And that will show me that you want to see more of this series. The truth is, guys, I was very bored of just making videos about command blocks and being a nerd. So I wanted to try and play Minecraft for real. This is the result. So please, give me an excuse to play Minecraft for real alone. I'm going to be totally and, and just, just completely honest with you. 
I've never beaten Minecraft on my own. Yes, I've been playing this game since 2012. I have never beaten Minecraft on my own, and that will change. I'm going to become a better Minecraft player, and I'm going to prove all of the haters wrong, okay? So, help help me do this by leaving a like and subscribing. This is my campaign. Go fund me. Add flyover. What? Why did I... Why did I say that?